Hey amazing hackers, I'm Tor Hat from HM Cyber Academy. We are going to continue with our incredible web hacking series. Here you're going to learn hacking or you'll die trying. So let's get started. Now we are solving NATO 6. Okay. It is saying input something. Okay, input a secret and uh, we don't know what this uh, secret is so let's submit it it is saying wrong secret okay there is uh, something called view source here okay let's check the page source first okay there is nothing okay input secret and it is just submitting and view source okay hmm right so let's view this okay so let's click on this so this is what we get so this is the html content and this is the some php code okay this is all the php code that we can get here okay right so <clears throat> so why they have given this code okay so this is one of the interesting thing that is that uh, differentiate from uh, other war games okay so if you go <clears throat> if you go to any other war game you have to do a lot of guesswork okay so a lot of guesswork uh, it's not easy okay but here we can only concentrate on the vulnerability okay that's the main point of this uh, netus over the wire war games so we don't need to con take concentrate on lot of guesswork okay we can only focus on the vulnerability so what they have given is they have given some content here okay right so this is a php code how do you know it's a php code because this syntax refers to php code okay usually if it is html we start with the html tags if it is uh, mm, javascript they will have script tags okay so if it, if it has a less than question mark and greater than question mark it is a php code okay and uh, it is including some file okay and this file is taking uh, our post okay our our post okay our post request which is here okay our post request is right here this one okay <clears throat> this is where we posted or asdf something adsf okay and this is what we are submitting what do you call a parameter okay this is the parameter that it is storing and and once it is submitted it is uh, taking this adsf into this secret and it is comparing okay in this post request there is a secret parameter okay so it has to compare with the actual secret that it has okay so where does it this this secret this is nowhere initialized right but here we have included a file okay this file must be containing this secret okay only then you can compare with what we have given okay we have given a post request that has been submitted okay and the, in this post request there is another parameter called secret okay this one <coughs> so this secret contains some data and this data is to be compared with the the secret that they have okay that these people have okay okay once it matches only then you have uh, the password okay if it doesn't uh, exist then you you can uh, just print wrong secret okay <clears throat> here we get wrong secret if you type anything else okay it will say wrong secret only if the secret matches the secret which they have only then you can uh, access this so let's go to this directory let's duplicate this and uh, paste it here yeah they are saying it is forbidden okay you do not have permission to access this resource 
hmm interesting they don't have a directory listing here okay so we cannot list directories but can we access the files okay that's another question we need to ask ourselves can we access the file directly the answer is yes we can access it okay usually if it is a php code it it simply executes and it shows nothing okay you might have to just uh, check this source code only then you can find this file or else if it is something else if it is something like php you will not be able to see it okay but since it is uh, inc you can actually see it okay so it has some secret uh, content here okay so this is stored in here and this secret is being tested here okay with uh, the input that we have given so let's paste this okay so let's paste this gibberish and uh, let's submit it and here we got our password for nata 7 okay all right then the main takeaway here is that <coughs> we we cannot sometimes we cannot access directories but we can access the file directly okay so that that file might contain uh, some juicy juicy information okay so this is uh, this is not a guesswork here they have directly given us but if we have to guess we will use something like a deer buster or something like that to just uh, navigate to all the files okay so all the files will be listed and we can uh, go through them one by one and we can know extra information okay so that's one way to do it so that's a realistic scenario but they this is just a ctf so they have directly given what we want okay so there is no guesswork here the, we just they just want us to learn the vulnerability okay so keep that in mind i'll see you guys in the next video